Good morning, super cold party people. I just woke up, so I'm barely with it, but... Look, it's blue skies. There's even like some terrible looking rain clouds over there. I'm so happy I'm gonna be able to breathe. I'm so happy. Anyways, my my vision's like super blurry still right now because I just woke up and I need to get ready to go. So I will see you later. Well, I am outside for the first time in what feels like forever. It is so windy today, but it's great because the air is awesome. It looks like clouds are rolling in, so maybe rain, which would be good too. But yeah, I'm just going to check some internet and stuff and then go up to the house and make some folds. Just about done my break. I'm back in the exact same spot I was in last time, really just checking internet and stuff. Um, I had a very chill break, just ate a bunch of food, relaxed, finally got to open the window in my room to let my room air out because it's been like closed forever because of the smoke. And then I brought down the full-time staff member's laundry back to her house because she had asked if I could switch it over for her. So I brought it down and it was like just about our cabin and her dog showed up and they're like, da -da -da -da, and one was like, let me in, let me in. And the other one was like, come love me, Strudel, Strudel, come love me like you want to be in the house. And then Strudel and I were just hanging out here and then she, her mom came back in and I was like, oh, she's on the dock, go get her. And away she went. So off to the dock she went to greet her mom. Strudel's such a good pup. Anyways, just about time to go back to work fun times it's still super windy like crazy windy but I'll take it a hundred percent any day over the smoke any day alrighty well I have made it home from work now it is just about 7 30 the laundry room was a disaster like one looked like a mud monster had gone into it and the other one someone had somehow managed to like jam the soap dispenser so it just poured all the soap everywhere it was probably like three cups of soap on the ground Great fun. So that took a while to clean up, but now I'm home. Um, we're gonna have some of the other people up for dinner tonight because we have salmon that some people gave us like, whew, I think a week and a half ago we had to throw it in the freezer because we like didn't eat it and then we didn't eat it. So we're like, ah, we better put this in the freezer. So we're doing that with like veggies and rice, I think. So that should be fun. Just a chill night. Maybe we will watch a movie. I'm not sure. But yeah, should be good. So we just finished watching the movie and having dinner. We watched Big Hero 6. I think I mentioned that. Um, it was good. <laughs> I was going to keep talking and then my brain just stopped. And then um, me and the one girl were cleaning up and we were humming. It's, I wouldn't even call it humming. We were just making weird noises to a whole new world from Aladdin. Because that's what we do. But yeah, I think I'm going to get ready for bed now. I feel like I look like a crypt keeper or something. But what can you do? And, um, yeah, then changing my pajamas, too. Brain needs to work a little better at this juncture. Hmm. It's only quarter to ten. This is bad. All right, well, I just spent, like, an hour going through my planning guides for my book, trying to, like, get back on that train or something, or at least feel accomplished. So I went all the way through the notes for book two, even though book two is different now. I'm not exactly sure where book two ends. Am I? No? I don't know. I should probably figure that out at some point. I know where book two starts, I know where book one ends, but yeah, so that was good. I feel like I've done something. I'm trying to like get my brain back into that mindset of that story. There's still a few issues that I'm like, this doesn't make sense, this doesn't make sense, but maybe it'll make sense when I get there. But that's all good, so I think now it's time to put on a show and pass out because it's almost 11 and I like to get as much sleep as I can. So with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on today's adventure and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.